Isn't that charming? This is another piece that the orchestra hasn't played in its long history in this format. It's a waltz by Franz Leha, based around tunes from the Merry Widow operetta. Now, the Merry Widow is uh, quite a fun story, actually. It's about this lady of this sort of very Ruritanian European country somewhere, not a very big place, who's very, very rich because her husband has died. Hence the title, The Merry Widow. And um, anyway, she, she is so rich that the government are thinking of passing a law that she cannot marry anyone outside the country because otherwise the country will go bankrupt. It's amazing how art repeats life, but I hear that they're thinking of doing such a thing in Greece at the moment. <laughs> anyway, <clears throat> while you're listening to this, um, you can imagine all the beautiful waltzes, and uh, there's even a little hint of the glorious restaurant in Paris, France, not Texas, called Maxime's. Um, they make off to Chez Maxime's. It's a very famous restaurant uh, right at the center of Paris. If you've never been to Paris, Ladies, I would get him to take you to Maxime's because it's that kind of a place you really need to go once. But make sure that you take your wallet with you and, um, and, and you're prepared to queue as well, or line up, I should say here, shouldn't I? But make sure you're prepared to line up. This um, glorious waltz at the end features uh, solo violins and solo cello uh, playing the magnificent duet, uh, which ends with the magical words, I love you. So if you're here tonight um, with somebody special or just your husband, then... <laughs> I would just reach across and grab their hand at the appropriate moment. But please do be careful. Thank you.